Uh, students, now coming to the next uh, layer that is the fifth layer in OSI reference model that is a session layer. So what this uh, session layer will do? It manages and synchronize the conversion between conversion between two different applications. So the first operation this session layer will do is it manages and synchronizes the conversion that takes place between two different applications. Okay. And next it is responsible. It is responsible for establishing establishment of connection. So it is first thing is it is establishing the connection and maintenance maintenance of session okay it is also maintaining the session and it is doing the authentication authentication and also ensure security so these are the responsibilities of the session layer the session layer will establish the connection so it just a connection will be established with the help of session layer and next it maintains the session whatever it is created suppose if you if you want to send the message the presentation layer whatever the present uh, the above layer uh, from session layer the session la uh, the presentation layer is sends an encrypted data so that data has to be maintain a session so whenever you are uh, executing some programs in the uh, whatever the application program you have taken so in that program you can see the session is expired so what it means uh, it is maintaining some sessions means a time will be allotted to that message so whatever the message that is taken from physical layer that a session will be created to that physical layer uh, physical sorry presentation layer data so that lay data whatever the encrypted form that will be uh, created a session so whenever the session is expired the data will be decrypted okay so for that case we are maintaining a session and it is this session is provided with authentication and also ensures the security so what are the functions that are uh, present in the session layer functions so the functions are first uh, session is established session establishment maintenance and terminate maintenance and termination so this is the first this is the first function that is doing and next it's synchronizing the data so whatever the data that is taking from the physical uh, presentation layer that data will be synchronized and next it is doing the dialogue control also dialogue controller is there so what is this dialogue controller will do so this session layer determines which device will communicate first okay which device will communicate first and the amount of data that will be sent that will be decided by this dialogue control so it's selecting the amount of data sent it determines the amount of data sent and also it determines which device will communicate which device will communicate so this is about the session layer now let us see the next layer that is a uh, uh, presentation layer so the name itself is saying that we are presenting so the next sixth layer presentation presentation layer so what this layer will do this presentation layer is also called as translation layer not transport it is translation layer why we are calling this is a translation layer because it is converting the whatever the message that application is sending that message will be converted into encryption form mean to another for another code one form of code is converted into another form 
so that's why we call it as a translation layer so here it presents uh, so whatever the it mainly concerned with the syntax and semantics of information it concern with syntax and semantics of information okay so and also it does the operations like uh, data compression data will be compressed whatever it is taken from application layer that data will be compressed and data encryption will be there data encryption and also data conversion is also there data conversion so whatever the data that is encrypted that has to be converted to the original form etc so here in the presentation layer data is compressed data is encrypted and data is converted <laughs> now let us see the functions of uh, presentation layer so what are the functions the functions are here the first one is translation so what it is translating it is trans let us take for example ascii to apsidic it is converting the ascii language language to apsidic language and next it is encrypted or decrypted it can do encryption or decryption so first whatever the data that is taken from the application layer that data has is to be encrypted by using data encryption the it translates the data into another form or a code so after uh, data is transferred to the destination again there the presentation layer has to be decrypt the data whatever the encrypted data that has to be decrypted then only the user can see what information uh, or sending from sender to the receiver so just a security purpose and next is compression next function is compression compression means it reduces the number of bits to transmitted on networks just it reducing the number of bits so this is about the presentation layer thank you